Welcome to readtheticket.com. Today I would like to talk about the RTT Market Pulse Indicator. This is our version of the Hilbert sine wave. This indicator finds cycles based on the sine wave. In our version, we have added a green shade area. The darker the shade, the more likely that the price is trending and there is no cycles present. For example here, this is a high cycle zone. Here we have more trend action, more trend action, more trend action. This goes to show where the indicator may be more effective on both buys and sells. But on an uptrend environment, all indicators that are blue are significant. Using our RTT trend status tool, we can determine that the price is in an uptrend over this period of time. So therefore we are only interested and in the blue support signals and we do not need the red resistance signals so we can remove those here's the market pulse indicator the selections period support resistance we'll make that more opaque rebuild the chart and here you see we have highlighted the bullish signals of the RTT market pulse indicator. When these show up, your attention should be brought forward to the price action. The triangles are where the signal generated. As you can see, taking positions around these zones can be very rewarding. If I go back and highlight the resistance zones, You can see that the resistance zones can be used as breakouts when the trend is up. Breakout, breakout, false breakout, breakout. There are two trading decisions with cycles. There's a trade with the cycle, trade with the cycle, and there's a trade when the cycle breaks. For example here, cycle requested to turn down, the price breaks up. This is an inversion. You will learn more definitive work with cycles. Jim Hurst methodology. Thanks for watching.